uh, YouTube for me. Uh, I want people to have the opportunity to share their thoughts if they want to share their thoughts. Um, but please don't abuse the comment section. Uh, some people do. Um, I'm not going to be looking at it, so I'm trusting you to be fair in your comments. And I'm trusting other people to watch out under the video and if anybody's abusing under the video to to uh, alert YouTube about that so so I'll give people the opportunity to share their thoughts and in a few weeks time I'll come back and see what people have to say and I will be uh, preaching from time to time on YouTube so I'm just trusting that the YouTube community the atheist community will see sense and show some compassion and realize that um, to have more of a balanced approach towards me and um, to recognize that um, I'm not going to go away and that I am going to continue to preach the Word of God and to recognize the, the difficult journey that I had to, and, and all the rest of it uh, and to recognize that things have recently got out of hand and that we just have to be gracious to each other and um, try and build bridges so I'm hoping that some people see sense in the next few weeks but I'm not going to stress about it, I'm not going to worry about it I don't want Christians to worry about I'm addicted to YouTube because I'm going to be staying away uh, for, a whole, for a long holiday I don't want uh, atheists to stress that they're going to worry that I'm going to come on and start attacking them and uh, making lots of videos against them so you don't have to worry about that, I'm not going to be doing that I'm just going to be chilling out for the next few weeks and hoping that things resolve themselves uh, that's what I'm hoping All right. And I just wanted people to see my face, I wanted you to see that I'm okay and I wanted you to see that also that humiliation trying to break me is not going to work because it's made me stronger but stronger in a more positive sense um, and so there we are and I just wanted people who were worried about me thinking that this was going to finish me off I wanted you to see that it's not finished me off it's made me stronger but it's made me stronger in a more positive sense it's made me re rediscover who I am and it, it's, bring, it's just brought uh, a radical healing because it's made me recognize my calling all my grief and struggles have been because I didn't know who I was anymore and I now know who I am who am I? Who am I? I'm the chief of sinners called to preach the gospel of grace. That's who I am. Alright, God bless and have a lovely day. And um, see you around. Don't forget, folks. Don't forget to read. Not this one. Herman Bavink. Herman Bavink. Herman Bavink. Reform Dogmatics, four volumes. I haven't got it. I read it a few years ago. This is the smaller version. Herman Bavink. Reform Dogmatics. All right, Herman Bavink, Reform Dogmatics, four volumes, creme de la creme.
a must read in your life has got to be a must read you are missing a treat if you do not read those four volumes of Herman Bavinck I'll push it again and I will show you I will show you we'll just have a little light relief for a minute I will show you my f favorite song at the moment that I'm in that I like yeah oh yeah it's good to be alive folks oh 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 I've got to be here it's coming out the crazy side's just coming out I've got to calm down Jay calm down calm down you just done the word of God calm down all right hey bye hey hey have you noticed something have you noticed something folks my sideburns are getting better my sideburns are getting better who cut my hair over those years does any what was going on over those years my hair cuts were so bad I was going to these people these women over the years paying them three pounds there's these cheap hair places where you can get your hair cut for three pounds and so I go to these cheap hairdressers and they cut me hair and they butchered it and I looked crazy over the years but I've started going to hairdressers uh, where you pay ten pounds this this guy was a Turk Turkish guy and it, I think it was eight pounds but um, the um, the uh, normally I go to two ladies and it's ten pounds to get your hair cut so my sideburns are looking a lot better these are reformed sideburns just joking that's an in-house joke all right so uh, I love the, I lo there. I'll show you this this is really I absolutely love these if anybody wants to get me a birthday present this would be a great birthday present or a Christmas present if I ever want it all club together and get me a Christmas present is this the reform dogmatics you see it yeah And then I'm going to show you now something else. I'm going to show you. I've got to be careful because I don't want to get done for copyright thing. So, you job, your job. Here we are. Here we are now, folks. I'll just show you. Gotta go, gotta go. This, I absolutely love this. This is mine. I'm going to play a, a couple of seconds. Play anymore. 
but uh, that's one of my favourite songs at the moment. So that's it. I gotta go. And uh, love to everybody out there. Take care. And uh, I've gotta go. All right. God bless. I'll try to keep the crazy side down. Take care. God bless. Love to everybody out there. And behave yourselves. All right. Behave yourselves. Yeah. Can you see down there? Can you see? I don't know if you can see. Yeah, I don't think you can see, mate. But you see over there. Cows over there. Cows. It's a lovely day. It's a day to enjoy. So enjoy the day, everybody. Atheist, Christian, Jew, Muslim, whoever you are, enjoy the day. Got to go. And so God bless.